What we have at Montgomery College is a small scale example of what we hope for the world. A diverse community of students who started off in separate areas of the world. I am from Ethiopia, China, Vietnam, Hungary, DC. We only got one climate on one planet. Let's not screw it up. When approached with a task, as a society, we should all contribute. A responsibility, a problem. Fix one thing first, and when that thing is done being fixed, you go to the next step. And in the end, it's going to be like, not at least a perfect environment, but at least a better environment than what we have today. We're using so much of our resources. I guess the regrowth is slower than how much we take. These students came together. One distinct memory I have is going on a walk on the trail with my dad. And we were just, you know, enjoying the animals, enjoying the trees. It was just, it was nice. It was peaceful. And I want people to be able to have that in the future. And with weapons like this, I would love to play basketball, go out, hang out with friends, and just hang out and just watch the sky. We need to take a step into making sure that we keep an eye on these things. There's a saying that says, we don't inherit the earth from our parents, we borrow it from our children. If we want our children to have a good future, a healthy future, we need to take part in giving them a world that they're ready to inhabit and take care of themselves. Reduce, reuse, recycle! Recycle. You can do anything. You just have to step out of your comfort zone and take it on and say, I want to do something, I want to make a difference. Ideas that made a difference. A difference to themselves, each other, their community, their children, and their planet. So I am very concerned about water pollution because it's affecting our health. Um, it's affecting wildlife out there. People who live in the city, they could use their bikes to go from place to place instead of taking their car. All this technology, why aren't they using it to you know, push water-driven cars or cars that run on like biofuel. We're in the process of designing like, these machines that converts high, um, hydrogen into energy for the cars, for the automobiles. Just that way it won't spew like carbon monoxide. And I think well, that would be a very good solution. Americans use 50 million disposable water bottles every day. If we all switched to reusable, we would save over 3 billion pounds of plastic from the landfills. For the people that have the party, but we're leaving our kids to clean it up. So we have to stop and now get as many young people involved in things like this as humanly possible because unfortunately they're the ones that are gonna lose from what we've done. If we say that we really care for our environment, we shouldn't just say it, we should actually do something. Social media is a very powerful thing. Get it on Twitter, Tumblr, Facebook, Instagram, even Snapchat. We can get this out. I'm from South Korea, El Salvador, Brazil, Rwanda, East Africa. I am from Indonesia. Every individual has the potential to be powerful, but together we have the power to be unstoppable. My name is Carlos. I'm a student from the sociology department making a short film called One World, One Responsibility and Many Solutions. This uh, short film will talk about climate change and I want to invite you guys to participate in our film and help us out to accomplish this uh, project. Yeah.